Hello everyone, welcome to the video. My name is Samuel Liam. I'm a second year medical student and the founder of the IMAT community. So in today's video, we're going to be speaking about how you can pass your IMAT exam in the last 60 days. Um, and essentially, this video is going to be divided into two parts. The first part designed for the students that have already been preparing. And the second part for the students that are very new okay, to the IMAT um, preparation. Okay, so let's get to it. So for the students that are already preparing for some time, if you are almost done with your preparation or you are done with your preparation, you are very, very in a very good position at the moment. Okay. Now, if you are almost done with your preparation, just finish, just study the syllabus. Whenever you finish with the syllabus, um, go and start doing MCQs. Okay. Multiple choice questions. Okay. Start doing MCQs, get that BMAT. Um, question book get the imat question book um, and start doing practice questions on the topics that you learn okay you really have to start um, putting your knowledge a test okay so for every single topic that you learn so far make sure that you do an mcq on it okay and then you write a list right list of topics that you are good at and list of topics that you need to improve okay then you write all of the list of the things that you're good, all of the list of the topics that you're not good, okay? Then obviously, start focusing on the topics that you're not good until you reach an overall position that overall you're very, very good, okay? Now, once you reach this position, obviously, keep doing your Anki or whatever flashcard and revision methods you're using and then just move on to past papers and simulator exams, okay? Now, essentially, you just have to practice um timekeeping and solving the IMAT exam and you have to be doing this alongside mcqs until your exam date if you do this and you get in an overall i don't know 40 40 plus 40 45 plus points on the IMAT, on the on the on the um, past papers i would say you're in a very good position okay now for the students that are literally just starting the preparation you are very short in time, okay? Especially if you don't already have a base, okay? If you don't have a base in, in sciences, that's gonna make your life a little bit harder, okay? But nothing, it does not mean that it's impossible by any means, okay? Now, first of all, you need to have a syllabus, okay? You need to have a plan. You need to mainly focus on the topics that are high yield, meaning the topics that always come on the IMAT over and over again, okay? So you can find links down below um, for syllabus, for our syllabus and for different articles that we have on our website. Also, we also have a course, a live course now in August and a online course that uh, you can take as well for the 2025 cohort. For the 2024 cohort, we only have the live course, okay? Now, you need to know the syllabus, okay? You need to know exactly what you're studying. You also need to put a lot of hours and a lot of dedication to make sure that you're covering all the syllabus at least all of the important things that you should cover okay now when you cover the important topics you essentially do the same thing do mcqs but don't stay so much time on it just find out the the, the, the bits where you're weak on and then start moving in to uh, practice papers okay like um, simulators and past papers okay of the IMAT exam and BMAT exam as well so just do this and try to improve your score and always finding your weakness finding the topics that you're weak on um, this is going to help you very very much okay hope that helped it was a very short video but it's a, it's a very common thing that a lot of students are not really sure on what to do or some students just study all over the place and the IMAT is a very topic specific, okay? We have topics coming up every single year, the same topics, okay? So it's very important that you know which topics are those and make sure that you know them because knowing them is just gonna make your life much easier, okay? Um, sooner to the IMAT exam, I'm gonna be sending a video on how to prepare itself prepare yourself prepare your mental health for the exam and any 
and tips and stress levels and, and that sort of thing. Okay, hope that helped. Um, feel free to check our website and join our WhatsApp community group. It's completely free of charge. You have a very nice community there that you can ask questions on every single type of topic of the IMAT, biology, chemistry, physics, maths, everything. And I believe there's, they'll be very helpful for you. But anyways, good luck on your exam and take care.